everybody, Travis from Spartan TC Reviews here. I'm out here today with the Sphinx SDP Compact. It's a nine millimeter pistol. Uh, it is hammer fired. Um, I'm sure some of you have seen some of my other videos where I talk about my feelings on hammer fired. Uh, I'm not a big fan of it, but I like to shoot them anyways. Um, this came in a couple weeks ago. Today is the first time that I've had the opportunity to get out and actually shoot it. Uh, I have been messing with it around the house, messing with the decocker, you know, getting myself familiar with the gun altogether. Um, I, I really like the trigger pull on it so far. We'll see how it is when I actually fire the gun. But there's a few things that I wanted to point out about it that I do like. Um, first off is you have changeable back straps. It comes with three of them total. Uh, really sturdy um, mounting for that. There's actually a pin that you have to drive out and a piece to pull the, the grip off. Um, small, medium, and large, you know, kind of like uh, the Smith & Wesson M&Ps. Uh, this is the small, just because I wanted to see how it felt. I like how slim it is. Um, one thing that I do really like is the fact that it is even though it, you know, it is a compact, but it does come, it does come with 15 round magazines. Uh, that's a big plus. You know, if you're gonna carry it, that's quite a few rounds. That's 30 rounds total between the two mags that it comes with, which is great. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, run a little bit of a shoot, video shooting it. We'll talk about it a little bit more and how I feel with shooting it. Well, I don't have a target set up today. I'm shooting at a block of wood down there. Um, it's just too windy. It's already blown the camera over, as you'll probably see in the, I think it was the vector video. Um, it's just Oklahoma wind. Every time I step out, it always uh, picks up. First impressions of shooting this, first 30 rounds, I like it. Um, I like the way that it feels. It's got a real nice recoil management. Um, the trigger is, is it's pretty impressive for a stock trigger. Uh, it's definitely one of the ones that I've come across that I really, really like uh, right off the bat. Um, you know, everybody talks about how uh, most stock triggers aren't all that great, but this is this is pretty good. Um, it's it's got some it's got a good light pull to it. Uh, it's got great response for the reset. It's a real short reset, as you can see here. Real short reset, um, real short trigger pull after the reset. So far I'm impressed. I'm looking forward to running quite a few rounds through this before I send it back to them. Um, I'm also running, uh, a little bit of plug for my buddies here, Miniman Munitions. If you haven't checked them out, go ahead and give them a, uh, give them a look. They do remanufactured ammo, nine millimeter, 45 and 40. Uh, their prices are great. They typically have a couple cases in, thousand round cases and whatnot. Um, you know, they're, they're extremely fair guys. The ammo that they make, you know, that they're, that they're remanufacturing, it's quality. It runs well. I've never had an issue. <coughs> never had an issue with any of it. It's always done great for me. Okay, so I'm going to force a couple malfunctions with the gun, uh, see how easy it is to clear it out.
Well, the one malfunction did jam up a bit. Uh, no big deal, I was able to get it loose. I'm sure you saw just by taking the front and putting it on the table. After putting 60 rounds through today, that's about all I've got time for. Um, my initial impressions of the Sphinx SDP are that it's a pretty good pistol. The trigger on it is is really crisp. Uh, it's really it's got a, a nice smooth break to it. Um, the reset is is extremely uh, tactile. I mean, you can feel it and you can hear it, even you know over other people firing and whatnot. Um, taking it from double action. Uh, it's actually not that bad. I've dealt with a lot of other pistols that I really didn't like the double action of them. The, the trigger pull is just, it was awful. Uh, the trigger pull on this is smooth. It's got a nice, it comes, it drops back really easy. Um, and then, you know, your single action after that is, it's, it's really nice. It does a great job. Uh, you know, like I've said before, I'm not a big fan of hammers, but when they're done right, uh, I'm a little more apt to pick them up and shoot them again. I'm really looking forward to bringing this out again. Uh, if I have it in my um, overall, I mean the sights so far. My impressions are the sights are really easy. You know, it's it's dead on uh, where I want it. I mean, I was hitting the same spot, you know, close to the same spot on that piece of wood, and I mean I'm only 10 yards away, but it's it's pretty accurate at that point. Um, I really, it's like I said. It's a, it's a good pistol. I, uh, I'm looking forward to spending a lot more time with it.